Young patients are getting syncope from vasovagal uh, etiology and we are able to avoid pacemakers in them. So, so autonomics has been around for a long time and autonomic ablation specifically but then the techniques vary a lot between centers and over the last few years some folks in Brazil have honed the way to do this and uh, they've taught the world how to do this and I went there for a few weeks and learned the procedure so I started the program at Mayo Clinic other centers did the same so now we are seeing success rates of over 90 percent in patients or young patients who are getting syncope from vasovagal uh, etiology and we are able to avoid pacemakers in them. So that, that's how I got into it, and I think it's a fascinating field. Uh. And from a global cardiology perspective, we all take care of these patients, and they're very, very challenging to manage. So it's amazing to hear that there are options for these patients. Yeah, absolutely. And then a lot of these patients get told that's a benign condition, and they can essentially do some conservative measures. But you know, try telling that to someone who's fallen, had a brain bleed, or someone who's uh, getting syncope episodes while driving, so for some of these patients, this is a lifesaver, it really changes their quality of life. So excited to be a part of the field that is bringing this about.